Hey you guys, Beth Brutality here and I am back with a new video. Um, this is kind of something different. This is a mail time video. Um, so I have not tried any of these products yet to review them. But I just got in my first conscious box. Hopefully you guys can see my address. So all these things here say that it is packed with love, 100% recycled. It's inks from veggies. The labels are BPA free and it is 1% for the planet. Don't know exactly what that means, but I'm sure it's in here. So inside is of course another box like there is with most subscription services. Um, however, both of these boxes are totally recyclable, so that's nice. Um, there's a very good chance I will reuse this box easily um, for mailing things because it's pretty much perfect for like pallets and things. So this is the box. Uh, easiest way I found to take it out is to literally just turn it upside down in your hand, pull the box out, and there you go. That's the top. It's really, really pretty. And as you guys saw on that image, that is actually inside. Oh, it's not the same. I thought it was the same. Okay, so I thought this image here was the same as this, but it's not. Whoops. Okay, so what that actually is is a window into a postcard, and it says what's inside. Um, so I think I packaged everything up pretty much how I found it. Um, so this is a very full box. Uh, for those of you who do not know, this is Conscious Box. It is $19 total. It's $12 for the box plus $7 shipping. Um, for those of you who are like, $7 shipping? This is a really heavy box. Like when I first picked it up, I was like, holy crap, this is a lot of stuff. Um, furthermore, they shipped it out on the 20th. I got it today on the 22nd and it came from California. So that is like really fast shipping. Um, it got to me in two days, so I'm not complaining about that. So inside, first and foremost, is a postcard. Uh, it's an actual postcard, so that's fun, because uh, it's kind of fun to send postcards. I don't know if anyone else still does that, but I enjoy it, I enjoy getting postcards. One of my friends, uh, the last postcard I got came from my friend when he was in Canada, and he just randomly sent me one, and it like made my year, so. Um, then there is this. This is all about everything that's in the box. It tells you what everything is, um, and kind of how they use them. Uh, so, I'm not gonna read this, I'm just gonna jump into it and if I have any concerns, I'll consult the card. First and foremost in here is the Climb On Intensive Skin Repair. Um, so from what I've gathered, this is um, geared towards climbers um, for when they get like rope burns and things like that. Um, I may be wrong, I haven't read the card. I probably should have. Um, but from what I can tell, um, that's what it is for. Uh, it says it is a Climb on essential oils have antibacterial, antiseptic, and and, and mm, I can't say that word, and now I cannot say that word. <sighs> See, now I'm thinking about it, so I'll never say it. A N A L G S I C, that word, and antiviral properties. It is chemical free, non toxic, and biodegradable. It is self safe for children and animals. Um, expect inconsistencies in texture and color, no fillers or perfumes. So essentially this is just a salve. Um, this is what my dad as a child we always called Indian salve. Um, it's, it smells good actually. Um, it doesn't smell like flowers or anything like that. But it smells good, um, and this is kind of, this is kind of like an all-purpose salve. Like, there's no other way to describe products like these. Um, but these are really awesome to have, actually, because sooner or later you need something like this. Like, you you can use it for anything. They say for um, anywhere the skin needs to be repaired, moisturized, or protected for cuts, scrapes, sunburns, rip tips, bites, chafing, chapping, blisters, cracked cuticles, psoriasis, eczema, etc. So this is what my dad calls Indian salve. You use it for everything, like everything. Like when I was a kid, like you got hurt, eh, I gotta put some Indian salve on it, kid. So this actually kind of makes me smile. I have kind of an emotional connection to that. Um, so in here, there, there's literally so many different things in here. Um, right here on top are the Crunch Master Multigrain Crackers in sea salt. These are certified gluten-free. Um, they may also be vegan. I don't immediately see the word vegan anywhere. Over they appear to be vegan. Um, unless there is some crazy hidden ingredient I just missed. These are vegan. So I will be tasting those. Those sound tasty. Um, and you get seven crackers in each bag. Next thing right on top here, and this is a big part of the weight I'm sure, is awesome. This is the Honest Kids Tropical Tango Punch. Um, for those of you who have never had it, there is a brand called Honest Tea, and it's really, really good tea. Um, and this is 
apparently they're juice boxes. So I'm super excited to try that because if you guys haven't noticed, I'm kind of a giant child at heart. So yeah, this has, it's sweetened with cane sugar uh, and white grape juice concentrate. It has lemon juice, it has mango flavor, it has orange flavor, it has orange juice concentrate, um, and then an organic mango blend as well as carotene, which is for the vitamin A and ascorbic acid for the vitamin C. Uh, so lots of good stuff in here and it is certified organic. So I'm excited to try this. Uh, I'll decide whether or not to, to share this with John. Um, also in here are St. Clair's Organics Raspberry Tarts. It says right on the box that they are vegan, so that always makes me smile. Um, the first ingredient is organic molasses granules, so that's actually kind of exciting. I don't think I've ever had anything in candy form that's sweetened with molasses. Um, but yeah, it's totally vegan, so I'm excited. It says it's also a lot of other things free, so that's exciting. So, and this is has about a little under 60, between 50 and 60 mints in it, so, or tarts, I shouldn't say mints. So I'm excited to try that. That'll probably go my brush belt at work. Um, next on tap is the Waleda Pomegranate Granada Grenade. I think I just read the wrong language. I don't even know. <laughs> it's a firming serum. Um, it has a whole lot of natural ingredients. I didn't immediately see anything in this that was not vegan, um, but I will have to email them and find out or even just ask Conscious Box. They probably know. Um, it may even say it somewhere on the box and I missed it. But this is a firming serum, so I will try this uh, as soon as I finish the current serum I'm using, which is a dark spot corrector, if you can't tell. <laughs> um, also in here is the Think Thin Crunch Fruit and Nut Bar. This is the Blueberry and Mixed Nut Bar. And let me see. It says contains peanuts, soy, almonds, and cashews, so unless they have eggs in there for some reason, this is probably vegan. Tapioca starch. Yeah, I think these are vegan. So I'm excited to try that. Oh wait, it says something about dairy, but it says it doesn't have dairy. It says vegan on it, okay, woo! So that's vegan, I'm gonna enjoy that. Um, also in here is the Mate Factor, uh, fresh yerba mate, I think it's mate, not mate. Uh, this is chai flavored, so I'm excited. This is one tea bag, and <laughs> sorry, John wasn't here to do it for me. Um, this. For those of you who don't know, this is like a really pure form of tea. Um, it actually can be used to help manage weight, apparently. Uh, I knew it was better for you. I didn't know it was that much better for you. Um, so I'm excited to try that. And it's chai, so I will enjoy that because I love chai. This is a mix of yerba mate, cinnamon, nutmeg, cardamom, ginger, clove, roasted chicory, and black pepper. So that is going to be a nice, spicy, tasty chai. So I'll probably mix that with some vanilla soy and be in heaven. Um, there are a few more things in here because yes, it just keeps coming. <laughs> uh, there is Berry Plus uh, laundry soap and this has two loads of laundry in it and this is the cutest thing I think I've ever seen in my life. So it has this cute little green chain, probably so that you can just like attach it to your laundry basket. But the way it is, ah, that didn't happen last time. It has little vials, and you dump one vial in for your soap, and it even says that uh, one microdose equals one laundry load, and cold water is best for the planet. So these are kind of cool. Um, I'm excited to try these because I have been kind of on the market for a different laundry soap. I was going to get something at Trader Joe's when this one ran out, but this has piqued my interest um, just because I am kind of feeling like I'm doing using a lot of harsh detergents on my clothes and I just don't like it. So, um, also in here, a gift from Bloomin'. It's seed paper. For those of you who have never played with something like this, this is the coolest thing ever. I think this is like so, it, it's a novelty, yes, but it's adorable. Um, it's paper that you plant and it has seeds in it and then it grows and this is a wildflower mix apparently. Um, and this also includes a coupon for 10% off your first order, but I'm not gonna tell you the coupon code because I don't know if I'm supposed to. I'll find out. If I'm allowed to, I'll list it below. Also in here, because there's more, are the crispy green, crispy mangoes. These are 100% freeze dried mangoes. I will probably give these to John depending on the texture. Um, I don't, there's something weird about mangoes to me that they taste a texture to me. Um, so there's a very good chance I'll give these to John, but these are vegan. Um, we'll try them together. 
and then he may end up eating most of them. <laughs> and two more things in here. The Natural Vitality Kids Natural Calm Multivitamin. Uh, this is a fruity splash flavor. So this is a dietary supplement, but it's a liquid. Can you hear it? Maybe. Um, I haven't been showing you guys anything, but everything's backwards because I don't know how to fix that because I'm stupid. I thought I fixed it and it's not, so. Um, but this is not vegan. This has uh, fish in it. So John will have to, well, that's not vegetarian either. Huh, I'm gonna have to have somebody randomly try this. <laughs> Excuse me, sir, can you drink this? <laughs> I'll get somebody to try it and let you know how it is. Um, and then, oh, no, Lisa doesn't eat seafood. Dang it! I really don't, I've gotta figure out who I'm gonna have try this. Um, yeah, we'll figure it out. And then the last thing in here, I don't know how I feel about this. I'll probably give this to John anyways, because it is beeswax, but it says 100% pure range chicken poop. <laughs> Put, put it on your lips. It says it's lip junk. I wonder if that's a typo or if it's supposed to say put, put it on your lips. And it says contains no poop, really, really big. Um, but the ingredients are avocado oil, which excites me because I love avocado. It just, it's a great fruit. Fruit, has a pit, fruit. Um, it has beeswax, jojoba oil, lavender essential oil, and sweet orange essential oil, as well as vitamin E. Um, so that sounds right up John's alley, actually. So I'll probably just give that to him today when he gets home. Um, and then the last things in here are literature. Uh, this is about the vitamin. This is about life ocean salt. And this was not something that was in the box, but this is a uh, coupon. There is a coupon in here for the multigrain crackers, these guys. Um, so there's a coupon for 50 cents off. So there's a very good chance I'll end up cashing those in if I find that brand near me. Um, and the last thing in here uh, was also not in the book or the box, but this is the Thrive Foods Direct. Um, they're meals that you order apparently, so that's kind of cool. Um, and there is a coupon code for 20% off, but again. Uh, I don't know if I can share these coupon codes. I will find out. If so, the coupon codes will be in the down bar below, but I probably won't know until like tomorrow. Maybe I'll just wait to post the video. I'll probably just wait to post the video. Um, so that is the end of my box. That is everything that is in there. And I am really excited to try some of this stuff. Um, I don't know where I'm gonna start. I'm kind of hungry, so I might, I don't wanna eat these things without John though. Meh. Okay, well, I will talk to all of you guys soon. Uh, if you guys have never heard of Conscious Box, you really, really need to check it out. I will put a link in the down bar below um, because next month they are going to have a vegan box as well as the regular Conscious Box. So for those of you who are vegan and want to try a subscription service, hello, Conscious Box, vegan box. So there will be a link to that in the down bar below. Um, I will be reviewing that one next month as well. Um, but don't wait, get it anyways, because then you're gonna be super bummed out when I get mine and you're like, dang, I wanted that. I definitely think these are worth the money, every single penny, as well as the shipping. I mean, it got to me in two days, and that is like the worst part of a subscription box is being like, your product shipped two weeks later. <laughs> so yeah, um, I definitely think it's worth every single cent, and I highly recommend this box. And you need to subscribe to it, and then we can open up our vegan boxes together next month. So. I will talk to all of you guys soon, and I will do some type of food review at some point this month since you guys are getting more interested in what I'm eating. Um, I think. If that doesn't sound like anything you guys want, just be like, don't do that, Beth. And I'll be like, okay. All right, I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.